right. So, all right. so John, Marcus from Doc Time there, yeah, uh, nice Natural you. Sports is at the show. And how's business going? And what do you guys got? It's hot excellent. And new? Excellent. Well, I don't know if you've seen the Russian lures that or not. No, I haven't. These, actually. Uh, <laughs> these are built in a Russian military facility. Okay. And uh, they have lures that you can jig with, that you can troll with. Uh, various styles are kind of retro looking, genuine silver brass, copper plating. Yeah. You can jig them, you can troll them. Uh, there's dual turbines that counter rotate, you don't need a swivel. <laughs> Super neat know. stuff. Yeah. Is this new for. That's brand new. We brought it in after the fishing show last year. I think we're the only people to distribute the lures, and they're very popular. Right on. How about on the rod side? What are on we the looking rods, at? You want to see something new, new, new? Let's see something new. Okay. Holy, lots of rods. How about a deal on a combo? Okay. $1,400, no tax. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Ultimate what do you think? travel combo. <laughs> Looks nice. Three piece. Stella and a GLX Escape. Is that a Stella on there? Yep. That's the nicest travel outfit you can buy right now. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You want to see new? NRX. NRX, and this is made by This oh, is G. Loomis' G. new Loomis rod. Stuff. Yeah. Uh, it's, the, it's the flagship of their whole series. They've got a new resin in, uh, nano resin. It's 20% uh, lighter and 20% stronger than their previous rod GLX. Oh, wow. 20% lighter. It won right? best to show at ICAST in, uh, in, Orlando, or in Las Vegas, rather. Very nice. And how much do these run for? Starting at 475. 479. Is that a show price or? Uh, we're including tax on our prices at the show. Oh, okay. Include taxes in. Right on. And uh, how about on the lure side? Let's. How about live target? I've seen that right all over, over the place. Well, I'm actually a big fan. It. We got tons of it. We uh, we stock almost every skew the company produces. Yeah. The best selling lure this year is the frog. Um, it's a soft body frog, similar to the many frogs that are on the market. They use a Daiichi hook, which is super sharp, and it's a realistic photo finish on the lure. It's the most realistic frog that's ever been available. Mm -hmm. They've got some other additions, some new colors in their cranks. Yeah. Crawfish green orange belly and a bright red orange belly. Diving depths from on the surface to right down to almost 20 feet. New sizes and divers in their perch. Uh, shallow lips in all sizes. Uh, wake baits, swim baits, gizzard shads. I think the only thing they don't have is a live target worm. Aren't these new too? The small three, yep. three and a half inch? New, new sizes in, uh, in the swim baits and then a full line of wake baits as well. They've even added a prop bait to the lineup. Prop bait. Ooh. For the top water guys. Uh huh. Actually, I bought one at the fishing show there you a couple go. weeks a week, a couple weeks ago. Awesome. Awesome. So yeah, that's that's the number one selling hard body lure in the market right now. Just because the, why the, the hooks construction and how lifelike it really it, is. Here's the deal. For a long time, there's been lifelike lures made that the fisherman felt like he was being sold a bill of goods because it looked great, but the action wasn't there or it just wasn't built really for catching yeah. fish. But fishermen, these things have been uh, have been proven. Each design swims how it's supposed to. They use quality components on it, so it's the it's the real deal. It looks great and it catches tons of fish. So yeah, like you mentioned, the, the hard body frog bait. I know I've seen this. This is new. Yep. And it's been selling like hotcakes. It is. Why? Yep. Um, people have been using Zara spook type baits or surface baits that you walk the dog with for yep. a lot of years. Okay. And uh, typically it's been a bait fish imitation. And so they're the first company to really introduce a frog profile to that walk in the dog type action. So you can walk the dog with this thing? It's designed to. Really? Yep. Okay. We're going to have to pick some up. <laughs> <laughs> How about something new from the soft? Yes, market. absolutely. Yeah, what do we got? A couple new things out on the market. From Pure Fishing in Berkeley, new Havoc bait. Okay, yeah. Several different styles available. We brought in the flipping baits. Uh, you've got creature type baits for fishing in the lily pads or Duncan. Real wide body profile, looks like a craw. Mm -hmm. Designed to fish right in the junk or to flip with the lily pads or in the, in the wood and the docks and that sort of thing. Yeah. Uh, similar bait. The Pit Boss, and this is a similar bait with a deeper, wider body. Okay. And it's designed again like a flipping bait, something that you can put a tungsten weight on, uh, light underhand pitch, quiet water entry, and it's a, a craw type profile. 
Are they uh, salt impregnated? And uh, these baits are unscented, but they do have tournament colors. Uh, tournament these colors, these okay. were designed as the label shows. Bobby Lane did this one. Skeet Reese did this one. All right. um, Berkeley top of the line pros. Yeah, Berkeley's starting to bring out some baits that uh, you know are improving tournament colors for the guys who want to try something different. Okay. Yeah. How about from uh, Strike Zone, right behind you? Yeah, Mark Kulik's got some new baits from Strike Zone. Um, he, he first came out with the Slammer, which was a big hit. Now he's got a, a Shiver Shad uh, drop shot bait. Real slim profile in all the popular drop shot colors, minnows, green pumpkins. He made a mini Slammer called a Pan Slammer for the guys who like fishing for crappies and bluegills. Yep. Uh, he's also got a leech bait. This is kind of really unique. There's lots oh, of leeches on the market, but he designed this one so that it's thick in the middle and it tapers at either end so you can wacky rig it. Nice. Super nice. It's also got a solid uh, wide nose on it if you do want to fish it drop shot style with a round bend hook. And what were these are called what again? These are a wacky leech. Wacky leech. No strike zone. Okay. There's another thing on the wish list. And hook-wise, anything new uh, and exciting in the hook -wise, 11? there isn't a whole lot of stuff out. The big boom was last year when they brought out the great big beasts and the swim bait hooks. Yeah. Um, we carry trocar hooks, which are really popular. These were new last year. Uh, owner wide gap uh, wacky hooks, and they're anodized in camo green. A lot of the baits that you're using drop shotting have that olive green or green pumpkin look to them. Yep. And the hook hides nicely in there with that green finish, ultra wide gap. Uh, we sell a lot of the Gamma Katsu in the, uh, in the weedless wide gap for wacky rigging as well. I mean, the Senko bait has taken off. It's, it's the number one plastic for most fishermen. Anyone can catch fish on a Senko. Agreed. One of my favorite baits. Mm -hmm. So uh, Natural Sports always, obviously carries all this stuff in their store constantly. We carry a wide selection for yeah. all different types of fishing. All different types yeah, of fishing. Yeah, you bet we do. Okay, right on. Thank you very much, hey, sir. Hey, you're welcome. John, appreciate it. Hey, anytime.